Bellaboos, welcome back to a video, you guys. I hope each and every one of you guys are having a great day, a blessed day. I hope it is your day is grand. But I want to thank you so much for tuning into this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And to all of my already Bellaboos, you know that I love you so much, and I know you love me because that's why you subscribed. Okay, okay. Anyways, so today, 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 I am going to get my hair cut as you guys can see my hair is this is my real hair i have a relaxer um one month one month stretch i think yeah one month one month stretched so i have a relaxer i'm about to get my hair cut um unfortunately because um, I recently had carpal tunnel. I wasn't able to really take care of my hair as much as I wanted to. So I am deciding to cut, cut my hair. And I'm sad. I'm so sad because I love long hair. I'm a long hair girly. Like, give me long hair. You know what I mean? Like, I want my hair to be down my back <laughs> but um yeah so I'm about to get my hair cut I'm gonna bring you guys with me so you guys can see the transformation um, I am also about to get up and show you guys uh, the damage um, and why so you can visually see like okay you can connect the dots okay that's what she's trying to cut her hair because it look like that so let's go ahead let me show you guys what it looked like so you guys could understand more of why I'm getting it cut let's go see okay so we've made it to the bathroom I'm about to turn around so you guys can see so it gets super thin right here okay I'm back so my when I had carpet tunnel like I said earlier my hair broke off a lot um, because what I did was I wasn't really able to do my hair so basically I just kept it in a uh, um, ponytail and when you know when you do that when you keep your hair in a ponytail it for a long period of time and I slept in a ponytail too you can really really get traction alopecia so that's why people always tell you um, I forgot what, what the hair people the hair doctors are taught are called but those type of doctors they always tell you to make sure that if you're going to wear certain hairstyles make sure you change it up like for a middle part, I shouldn't always wear I shouldn't always wear a middle part because I will start getting alopecia right here. Or for a ponytail, make sure when you do a point you do wear a ponytail, make sure you're not always having it in at one spot. Try to move it up, move it down, move it to the side, put a ponytail up here. It's just like don't always have that one particular hairstyle, and it's causing you're pulling like it's causing that friction. Um, so that's basically what happened to me i had carpet tunnel for like constant pain for at least two weeks so for two long weeks my hair was pulled back smoothed back too because my husband my husband did it he put a lot of gel on it smoothed it back into a ponytail for two weeks so that's basically why my hair broke off um and it and it and it broke off right here so you can tell like the ponytail is like super thin because my hair is on point of two weeks so i don't want anybody to think oh relax your hair that's why your hair broke off no boo boo it broke off because traction alopecia i kept my hair in a ponytail for two weeks because when you when you have carpal tunnel you can't do nothing literally like you can't do nothing you literally like my hand was either like this or like this i i had to type with this <laughs> It was so much stuff going on. That's a whole nother video. But so that's basically why I am I have decided to cut my hair is because I need to get it to one length. So that once I get it to that one length, then I am able 
to grow my hair back full again because right right now it's full up until about like right here so i don't know how much she's gonna cut off because she know how much i love long hair so she may not cut it off that high but i don't know we're gonna i don't know i'm trying not to think about it i don't want to get emotional i'm not trying to think about it too too much so i wanted i feel like my eyes was my bottom um waterline was kind of plain so i went in with that um a brown a dark brown eyeshadow i'm um, eyeshadow lord what am i even talking about so i feel like my eyes were kind of like plain i went in with a brown liner right here because i don't like when my eyes are plain so yeah i did my makeup because i'm recording obviously i had to do my makeup for my bill of booze y'all know I have to show off for y'all. So typically when I get my hair done, I don't do my makeup because obviously it's going to be water all right here. But I didn't really put a lot of makeup on my forehead, but I did put, you know, face, eyes, lips, you see. Do. Mm. Mm. But I need to figure out what I'm going to wear. It's 3 o'clock. It's 310. My hair appointment is at 4. And I need to also take this stuff back to Ulta. Which I may actually do tomorrow. No, I need to do it today. Yeah, so I need to figure out what I'm going to wear. Hopefully I can figure that out soon because I also need to get something. I haven't ate all day because I've been ripping and running. So, let me figure out what I'm going to wear. Hold on. Okay, so I'm rushing. But um, I need to change out my purse because I'm bringing y'all, obviously. So, I need to bring a easier purse to carry. But scent for today is um, Champagne Toast by... Um, What's that place called bath and body works and i'm probably gonna go on top of this with the juicy couture body oil from the hair store in my purse when i'm bringing y'all i usually like to bring an extra battery this light the mic i have on right now is my heavy duty mic so i'm gonna change it out to this mic um and then i'm gonna bring this tripod that y'all on right now but this tripod goes all the way down to the floor so it's way taller than this one so i'm gonna bring that i'm bringing the lip that i have on today which is ultimate slim by maybelline it is in the shade more taupe that's the lip i have on today so i'm gonna bring that because i gotta get some food because i'm so hungry i have to take some of this stuff out because i need to make room for y'all i'm tired i hope y'all are having a great day i feel like i don't really have much time to talk to y'all but I really hope you guys are having a great day. Hope you guys are enjoying my videos. Um, I want to thank everybody so much for just taking the time out to subscribe. Um, even though I always say that it is free. But support is always big for me. So the fact that y'all support me and y'all don't even know me. That's on a whole other level. But anyway, if I try to get emotional, I'm going to see y'all when we get in the car okay i'ma see y'all in the car okay so i made it finally i got my burger king i made it it's 359 so it's definitely time to go in and i'm so scared what if i don't like it that's what i keep thinking it's like what if i don't like it like that's gonna be that'd be so crazy if i don't like my hair i would be so sad let's go <laughs> i'm sad my head is burning.
I don't know if y'all can see, but I'm up under the steamer right now. Um, got 15 minutes up under here. And then I gotta get the cold shot. If y'all get your hair done in the salon, and y'all should already know, once you get that cold shot, girl, it's a lot. Like, you be for reason, for real. Like, you for real. This thing getting kind of hot. My makeup sweat. I'm boiling up. I'm steaming. Like, literally. Come on, forehead. I need to get another rag. But, yeah, so she gonna rest me out with cold water. And then we'll start the... The dreaded part. I hope she don't have to cut too much. I know she's gonna have to, but dang, this getting this getting for real. Like it's getting for real. Like I'm literally about to cut my hair. I have I haven't cut my hair in like a long time. This thing burning the heck out my forehead. Oh, I'm not ready. Oh, oh yeah. I'm not ready. Oh, Jesus, Jesus. Oh. This is about to be so sad. She look like Sherman Temple, but watch this beat. So this is the cut. She said, let me, I'm gonna turn around for y'all. So this is the cut. She said that basically the back of my head was the shortest, um, which is like the nape area. That's where it broke off the most during that, when I had carpal tunnel. And so, yeah, so it's officially done. Can't believe I cut my hair. Like, I'm sad. I've never had my hair this short before. She she did say that, she said that this side particularly, which is my right side, is health, was healthier, which was longer, and had less split ends than this side. I wonder if it's because I sleep on this side. I do sleep on this side of my, um, my, my side. My body, that's what I'm trying to say. So maybe that's why this side was more damaged. But I don't really, I can't remember if I, I mean, I know I have, it's not like I'm perfect. I can't remember it, how many times I slept without a bonnet. Cause if you sleep with a bonnet on, like it doesn't really matter what side, what side you sleep on or not because you have a bonnet on to protect your, your hair. But if you don't sleep with a bonnet on, that matters, but how do I feel? I feel okay. 
because I know my hair grows back fast, especially when I make my home my homemade uh, growth oil. I know my hair grows back really, really fast when I use that. I just have to endure this process, and it's not so big of a deal um, because at least it's not a pixie cut. Because I would be crying if it's a pixie cut. Um, so the fact that it's just, you know, it's just, I think it's neck length, whatever this is. Um, so it's not horrible. It's just something that I have to get used to. Um, yeah, so I am going to one day flat iron it to see how it looks. I had to go to Walmart. I know I love Walmart because I needed to get some bobby, some hands, uh, I guess to, so when I pin curl it, I have these instead of bobby pins. So yeah, that's what I got from Walmart. And I'm about to eat and try to pin curl this hair, which I've never pin curled hair before either. So this is gonna be different. She did tell me that what I need to do to, you know, which is known, I need to make sure that I am avoiding heat. So I'm gonna try my best to make sure that I avoid heat and by doing that, I'm gonna have to pin curl because these curls can last a week. Um, if I pin curl them, but if I don't pin curl them, then yeah, once I, once I start wrapping it, try that's over and done. So Shanti's over there, but she doing something. I will show y'all baby girl, but not in this video. This video is about me being sad. Mm -mm -mm. But anyways, you guys, this is the end of the video. Thank you guys so much. If you got to the end of this video, I want you to comment a red heart for your girl. Um, but I love you so much and I will see you guys on the next one. Stay tuned to more videos from Bella Boo herself and to all my Bella Boos, I love you. And you know, you know I love you, okay? So I will see you guys later. Thank you so much for listening, watching, subscribing, doing all this. Is You are the reason why I continue. Every time you watch my videos, it gives me a push to keep going. So I love you guys so much, and I will see you on the next one. Bye. You gotta work on, do it today. Tomorrow's not promised. <clears throat> Same. Yeah, sing your mercies every morning. Even though just yesterday all I did was ignore him. He could have took my breath away. But he got plans for me. That's the only reason why I seen another day. My sin was on the